Hello everybody, this is Nora with NAQ57 and today I bring you a review by Rosalind. These are two of uh, several, a variety of builder gels in a bottle that they do make. I have two different colors. I'm going to go ahead and remove these from the boxes and let you take a look. Here are the bottles out of the box and to let you know these are full size bottles at 15 ml. Let me go ahead and say, like I said, these are builder gels and a builder gel is one that you will use for an overlay of your natural nail or to extend your natural nails, meaning making them longer using by use of a paper form. So the two shades that I chose are this one is called the, well this one's the white. I'm expecting it to be a solid white. And let me go ahead and leave that like that. And this one, it's actually my favorite. I've already been using it. And it's an it's this um labeled as an opal, but it is, I don't know if you can tell on camera, it is meant to be a translucent white. So not a solid white. And did I mention it was my favorite? It is what you see on my nails right now, and I've actually used it on a couple of clients. As an overlay, I will have pictures at the end. And I also use, so then I use the white one to create the free edge tip, not on my nails, but in another client, I use the, um, the white one to create the, the natural, just so for a natural look of the white tips. And then I went over the entire nail with the opal one. What I'm going to do, guys, I do not have, I uh, will not have a demonstration on how to extend nails. What I want to do for this video uh, in the review, I'm going to swatch these two colors for you so you can see the difference between the white and the opal, or solid white and the translucent. I'm going to do uh, swatch them on these clear full tips here. So I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, so here are the two colors cured side by side. You can definitely tell the difference between the translucent white and the more opaque white. Even then, it's, it's not like completely solid white, so it's still so very pretty and very natural looking. I did remember, so this is um, on my pinky, and hopefully you can tell from underneath. I built, I lost this tip, so I built my free edge with the white one and then I went over as an overlay with the opal one. See how pretty that looks, you can't even tell the difference because I do have uh, my, my free edge are a natural white. Here they are, very pretty natural looking builder gel now as far as the get to give you some facts about this builder gel on a bottle it is self it self levels nicely i did like working with it it cures in 30 seconds but i will give it 60 especially this the more solid color one uh, it does have a tacky layer when it's a cure so if you want to finish it without any color over it and just so you can put a clear gel top coat um, be sure to wipe off the tacky layer buff and then apply anything uh, and any other type of gel polish that you want to if, if you want color on it uh, and it applies it does suggest to apply a base a gel base on the nail on the bare nail prior to applying this builder gel you can feel it fill this as it grows out you can do fills and it is, it is soak off. It will soak off so you don't have to. It is a soak off builder gel. Here are the bottles again. And again, these are 15 mLs. If you guys have any questions on these, please leave them below and I'll be happy to answer. This will conclude my video. I would like to thank Rosalind for sending me these beautiful gels to play with and review. Stay tuned for pictures at the end. If you guys enjoyed my video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and thank you for watching.